Hello and welcome to this tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to make this animated menu button. As you can see, as I click it, it forms a X button, and I can toggle between these two states by clicking on this button. Uh, this button can be very useful for some kind of menu system where you want to toggle the menu, maybe show it and hide it by clicking on this button. So let's start with our uh, HTML. First of all, let me place uh, anchor tag it's href attribute will be equal to pound sign because it does not lead anywhere give it a class of menu btn which stands for menu button inside this we will have uh, three div elements which will form these three menu blocks so menu let's give it a class of menu btn block and we'll give this class to every single div element uh, but also we'll give it an extra class of top let's highlight it, copy it, paste it two times this one's class will be equal to mill Oops. and this one's will be bottom and that's it for our HTML, let's get into CSS so not a we will give it a basic reset set the margin to zero paddings to zero and first of all let's let's target our menu btn so it's display property you will be set to block its width will be 48 pixels and height will be equal to 36 pixels we'll also give it some margin in this case just to push the button a bit down and to center it uh, next one is our menu button block give it a width of 100% its height will be equal to 6 pixels we also need some background color in this case I'm using color blue also a border radius 3 pixels and we also need to set transform origin to 0 and 50 percent uh, because we want to we want to rotate this element uh, from the left side horizontally and the middle vertically uh, this element so we were we we're setting it our x value to 0 and y value to 50 percent let's give it also a transition because we were using we will be using CSS3 animations and we want to animate transform property over 300 milliseconds and our function will be ease the next one is we will target the middle element middle block element dot middle We'll give it some top and bottom margin just to space out these buttons. So margin 9 pixels and 0 pixels. Next one is we will target menu btn block dot top dot active. And this active class will toggle using jQuery. So we want to transform this element, rotate it by 38, oops, 38 point, let's say to DEG, which stands for degrees. And here I have a Photoshop file. Let me explain it uh, to you how I got the angle I want to rotate this button. So, as you can see, uh, when we click on this button it turns into this 
X or a close button and uh, you can draw a triangle as you as I have done here so we want to we want to calculate this angle right here so as we, as you as we know this side is 48 pixels because our menu button blocks width is uh, 48 pixels and as we know our our menu buttons height in total is 36 pixels and as you can see this triangles uh, side and the top is in the middle of this menu block so we subtract 3 pixels from here and 3 pixels from here that gives us 30 pixels so using some math we divide 30 by 48 and cal calculate the inverse sine which gives us 38.682 degrees and that's the value I'm using right here uh, don't worry if you not uh, did not understand everything I will leave some link in the comments uh, with all the math explained so let's continue let's target our menu BTN block uh, in this case I will target a middle element and in the active state just highlight the copy and paste it we want to scale it and scale it to zero so this element disappears let's highlight this top element copy paste it and change this class to bottom and we want to rotate it on the other side so in the other direction so we put a minus sign so save it let's view our our button so far looking good yeah so the next thing is we need to toggle this button using jQuery so first of all let's fetch so cache these elements what menu button it's a anchor tag with a class so menu btn next one is menu button block and we're using menu button and find these elements inside it it's a there are divs with a class of menu btn block so when we click right here when we click our menu button we want to fire this function right here and it will toggle the active class uh, for these menu block elements so toggle class and we want to toggle the active class uh, so save it Let's into our browser refresh and there you have it we have a working menu button so as you saw the hardest part was the the math behind all of this the CSS HTML and and JavaScript was really simple so yeah uh, look forward to future tutorials we're going to use this code and this button to make uh, the whole navigation system menu system so thank you for watching see you next time bye